Hey everyone, welcome back to My Apple Zone, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about the brand new iMac. So let's get started. Today, Apple updated the all-in-one iMac with next-generation quad-core processors, powerful new graphics, high-speed Thunderbolt I.O., and a new FaceTime high-definition camera. The new iMacs feature quad-core Intel Core i5 processors with an option for customers to choose the Core i7 processor up to 3.4 GHz. The new iMacs with the Core i5 processor are up to 30% faster than the previous generation iMacs, and the iMacs with the Core i7 processor are up to 70% faster than the previous generation iMacs. The Core i7 processor provides a huge boost in performance. The 21.5 inch iMac has a single Thunderbolt port, while the 27 inch iMac features two Thunderbolt ports which allows you to drive two external monitors at the same time. Engadget did a review of the new iMacs and took a picture shown here of the iMac with two Thunderbolt ports supporting two displays. Those of you who do a lot of video editing will appreciate this feature and benefit from being able to use two displays with the iMac. With the introduction of the new iMacs, Apple is giving you the option to substitute the Magic Mouse for the Magic Trackpad. The new iMac start out at $1199 for the 21.5 inch 2.5 gigahertz quad core i5 and go all the way up to $1999 for the 27 inch 3.1 gigahertz quad core i5. There's a $200 option for the 3.4 gigahertz quad core i7 processor. Overall, you can't beat the price considering the new features and performance of the new iMacs. Well, that's been my quick review of the new iMacs. In an upcoming video, I'll be doing some benchmarking of the new iMacs with the new Core i5 and Core i7 processors. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up to support the channel. And until next time, I will talk to you later.